Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to be talking about a brand new support bot. Uh, it's a chat GPT-5 uh, rebel support bot. So you can ask it all sorts of different questions. I trained it on uh, rebel 7 and on rebel 8. So if you have the new version of the software, it's awesome. I love it. Uh, this painting on the screen is the first painting uh, that I, I did in a course with Daniel Ibanez. Uh, and if I said that with him on this video, he'd probably correct my pronunciation, Ibanez. And that's what I said, Daniel, Ibanez. Uh, anyway, that course will be available. You can find out more about it uh, here on the channel or in the Discord group. We'll make sure that that's, uh, that link is posted so you can find the course in the future. Okay, so let's look at the chatbot. Let's go into Discord. And I'll put a link to the Discord server. This is uh, the fan hosted, uh, aka I'm the host of Rebel. I'm going to go here on the left, Instant Support Bot 1 and 2. I'm still playing a little bit with the personality on this support bot, which is a really weird kind of thing to do. like changing the way someone acts, but it's a bot, but they act like a human. So let's go here and we're going to uh, ask it a question. In order to ask it a question, uh, all we have to do is type the at symbol and then instant. And you can type insta and it'll pull up the whole thing. Click enter. And let's say uh, we have a question. Uh, do I paint just on parts of the canvas that I've already painted. Click enter. Notice that there's a typo. And again, I'm, I'm really excited that this has just been upgraded to the new uh, ChatGPT 5. Uh, that's a wonderful thing. Two six ways. Pick your flavor. Lock transparency, select the layer, and press forward slash. Now you can only paint where pixels already exist on the layer, no coloring outside the lines. Second way, select painted pixels. Control Alt V, Windows, or Command Alt V, Mac, or Control or Command plus click. The layer thumbnail. Paint stays inside the selection. Supportinator approves this precision. Want me to show you how to save the selection for later? So Let's go over here and try it. I've I've been training the bot, so there's been a couple times where it's given an answer. I'm like, I don't think that's the best way to do it. Or uh, what we're referring to is this. So this has been refining and getting smarter and better. Okay, so we're going to start with control click. So now if I control click right here, we're not going to see anything. So I need to actually use uh, the radio menu and click control and then tap on the screen. You notice everything is selected because this layer has all the information on it. We're going to deselect with control D plus new layer. Okay, now I want to just play just with this. So I'm going to do that control and click. You would just hold the control key down. And now you can see this is selected. So we're going to let's, let's pick some here. And notice we're painting just on the selected pixels. You can actually create a new layer and do the same thing on the new layer. As we turn this off, you have the selection on the new layer. It's non-destructive, really cool. Let's look at the other way the InstaBot suggested. We're going to delete layer one, layer two, and deselect. Now we can, let's choose lock transparency. This item is in the layers panel, forward slash, we'll turn that on and off. And now let's paint right over the top. I like this way, it gives you a really nice way to blend paint and colors. And you don't have to deal with that uh, selection uh, outline. 
All right, so the Instabot just taught us two new things. You can ask it just about anything, and it does a really good job uh, giving you uh, very clear answers, well-organized information. Like I said, it has access to all of the Rebel manuals as well as a lot of information from my brain. Okay, this is available for free in the Discord. Go over there. There is also in the brushes download. I made some free bristle brushes. Uh, you can go in here. There's only a handful instead of Rebel 8. So if you don't have the bristle brushes, just drag this onto, just drag the zip file onto the canvas and it will place those here inside oil and acrylics, inside the bristle folder. All right, one final note. When you're using the Insta support bot, please go into these two channels. Uh, and then also, if you're replying to it, it will respond. So click on reply. Ask it a further question. Uh, if you don't use the at or do a reply, it won't respond to you. Our goal is to get the Rebel Discord community up to a thousand members. If you're only mildly interested, go over there and join because once we get to a thousand, we can appear in the Discord search option, which means it'll be easier for people to find the Discord server in the future. Thank you for watching. Until next time, stay creative and have a wonderful day.